We had some severe weather pop earlier, which makes today a first alert weather day. Chief Meteorologist Dave Aguileros with us now. Dave, you were crazy busy earlier this afternoon. Yeah, it was just rocking and rolling uh, from about 2 to 4 o'clock uh, with big thunderstorms up in Weld County. We have still are holding on to some storms out there that I'm worried about, but here in town, we're just getting some nice rain out there. Let's take a look. We start you off with our Lookout Mountain camera, and there's a lot of moisture out there. Look at all the clouds. It's gray. Temperatures on the cool side out there as well already. And take a look at this mile high. Everybody's going to see the Rolling Stones tonight down there. We're trying to hold the rain off, but they may get a little rain down there at mile high. It's 72 degrees uh, down there right now, and a few raindrops on the lens at the Tech Center, where it's also 72 there. And our first alert weather tracker has been uh, driving out uh, in Aurora near the Quincy area, moving out east out there. We got a really good rain shower from Aurora all the way back into Littleton. So some soaking rains, and it's feeling good out there. Here's the way it looks on the radar. We had a swath of uh, thunderstorms developing in southern Jefferson, Douglas County, moving into the south metro area. Had a little bit of rain right along C-470 and E-470. Right now, that is pushing out uh, across the road. Just light rain here. Uh, moderate rain downtown Denver all the way back to uh, about uh, I-225 uh, out that way. And nothing severe going on. Just some good soaking rains right across Arapahoe County at the moment. Heavier thunderstorms are still alive up north from Adams County into Morgan County. Not severe, but we do have some small hail here, some heavy rain and some really gusty winds. You see that green snaky line out ahead of it. These are wind gusts going 40 to 45 mile per hour pushing out ahead of it. And that extends up to northern Colorado where thunderstorms have uh, re-energized up there in Logan County right along uh, I-76 out there. So those have the potential to go severe tonight. So we're holding on to that severe thunderstorm watch till 7 o'clock. Uh, that might have to be extended out near Holyoke and Ray out here if that line gets any stronger out there into the evening tonight and a lot of moisture still coming up the pike uh, out there uh, across western Colorado here heavy rain in Montrose we got rain up in Eagle you can see it spreading all the way down to the four corners so we could have more showers and thunderstorms into the evening tonight in fact through midnight we have a chance of some showers and storms here in the Denver metro area and I just want to take a wide look at the satellite and radar if you remember Alberto slammed into Texas and Mexico down here eventually tomorrow afternoon some of that moisture may work its way up uh, into Colorado here. So we'll watch for that late in the day. I'll show it to you on the future cast. But for the short term tonight, showers and thunderstorms out west in the mountains and the eastern plains here. And they will continue into the late evening. Tomorrow morning, we could have a light sprinkle of rain with clouds and some fog here in Denver. Thunderstorms and showers from Pikes Peak down in the Sangre de Cristos and even central Colorado in the morning. We'll have some rain, maybe even some early morning thunderstorms. That continues in the afternoon. And then watch as that second surge of moisture comes in that I told you about. Heavy rains and severe thunderstorms western Colorado the Central Mountains in the afternoon. And some of that may move out over the eastern plains late in the day. For that reason, all of western Colorado, the western mountains, and from Denver out into the northeastern plains could see severe thunderstorms popping during the day tomorrow. So 87 for the high tomorrow with the first alert weather day. 92 on Saturday, mostly sunny and dry. And then the heat really cranks up. 94 on Sunday, 98 on Monday, just under 100 degrees by then. And we keep the 90s rolling. If you like the 90s, you got a whole mess of them all the way through the start of next week. <laughs> that is a mess. <laughs> Ooh, it's going to be hot. It is oh, summer, so here it we is. go. Yeah, right? it is. As, at 2.50 this afternoon, summer got here. They agreed it with a bang. Mm -hmm. There you go. We'll be right back.